guys, it's Alex. Welcome back to my channel. I am so happy you clicked on this video. I personally love watching what's in my bag videos and I thought I would do one today. If this is the first time you are seeing my face on your screen, make sure to click that subscribe button and I would love it if you joined me on my YouTube journey and also turn on those post notifications and this would definitely not be a self promotion if I didn't shout out my Instagram. So make sure you are following me there. Let's just get into what's in my bag. So this is my bag. It is a Louis Vuitton Neverfull MM, the medium size, and it's in the Damier Abeam print, and it has the nice pink rose ballerine interior. I'm just obsessed with this bag. If you want to see me going and shopping for this bag, I will leave that linked down below so you can check it out. It was my first time shopping in a luxury store, and it was just such a cool experience. I have a bag organizer. I'll take it out and show you guys. This is pretty much what my bag looks like on the inside. I kind of just wanted to show you an overview so you can kind of see what I keep in the bag and like what it looks like on the inside. I know that at least I like to see people's bags when you're doing what's in my bag so it's not like you're pulling things like out of the frame. So I'm gonna keep the bag here. The only thing that I don't keep in the organizer that I throw in between the organizer and the purse itself is my ID for work. And this is pretty much it. I have this black lanyard. So that's the only thing I really keep not in the organizer. So I'm just gonna take out the organizer so you guys can see this. I hope this is recording. Okay, it is. It's been so long since I filmed a video like this. Guys, it's not funny. So this is the organizer and I love this organizer because it doesn't make your purse boxy. It keeps the shape of the bag, um, which I really, really appreciate. This kind of pinches in. It's not like totally box. There's some organizers that are a legit box and it makes your bag look kind of ugly. So I absolutely love this one. If you want to get this, it doesn't have to be for like a Neverfull or Louis Vuitton bag. You can put it in any tote and I highly recommend it. It comes in like a lot of colors. I also love that it matches the Rose Ballerine perfectly. I was nervous that the pinks weren't going to match, but I'm just really glad that it matches. Starting from the front, I have my keys and I keep my keys in this like front pouch of the organizer because it's just really easy access to like grab your keys. I could keep it in this main compartment, but like I just don't really want to do that because then I would still be like rummaging for my keys and I don't want to be doing that. So I keep it in this front little slip right here, as you guys can see, so I can just grab it out. The next thing I have in this um, front pouch thing are like cards and stuff. So I have like anything flat. Um, I have these two copper closet, um, like $5 off coupons. Then I have a dentist coupon and a $10 bill. And then in the front pocket, I just have my AAA card, which I have one of these. I guess I have two AAA cards because I have one in um, this pouch. And then I have this Top Golf uh, little membership card. You get one every time you go to Top Golf. Um, it's a really fun place, but I highly recommend you go with a group of people or it will become super expensive. Then next, like I'm gonna go like front to back. So the next thing that's like in this organizer is these two pockets, these two pockets. I don't know if you guys can see that cause I cannot see it from where I'm sitting. Um, so the first pocket is just my phone. So again, really easy access. I could just stick it in the front here and then pull it out when I need it. Then I also have my birth control pills, which is in this nice cute little pouch thing. It actually came like this, kind of fancy. And then I have this little note card where I was kind of like sketching some designs um, cause there's this like contest at my job for redesigning the logo. And then in here I have my business cards and like a gift card and just like cards in general and cards I've designed. I've designed my own, but anyway. So I have like some of my cards and some of other people's cards in here. And then I have a Tylenol packet. And then I have this really cool um, thing. If you have a cold, this will act instantly. I got this at when I was at Disney and they gave this to me and it got rid of all my symptoms. So I've saved this. It's probably like bad now, but it worked wonders when I was feeling ill and stuff. So then the next thing is this big main compartment. 
this is like the big hole so that was like these two pockets and now we're gonna get into this big hole which there's not a lot of stuff in the big hole because I don't like a lot of stuff in my bag so I forgot to add this but I wanted to say that I carry my vlog camera and little tripod in this when I'm not at work so that wasn't in there because I had just gotten back from working. So my vlog camera's in there, it's the G7X. But the first thing is my Ray-Bans. I'm gonna set this down really quick so I can show you guys. I just have these like hexagonal Ray-Bans. You've seen them like a million times if you like watch my other videos. And then I have this soft glasses case because when I use the pouch, which I'll get to in a minute, I like to put my sunglasses in here so they don't get scratched because the big case won't fit in the pouch. I'll show you guys. And then next, I have an umbrella. And yes, an umbrella actually fits in here. It's really compact and like really convenient to have. Florida's like so crazy and sometimes it just starts pouring rain. So it's always good to have an umbrella with you. And then I have this notebook. It's literally my like everything when it comes to notes and paper and whatever. So it's nice to have. And then I have my planner. This is the WTF planner, which I think is really funny. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. But the WTF is like actually a little bit more bold. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's what the uh, planner looks like. I love this because it looks like a book and it doesn't look like an actual planner. And then getting on into, okay, well, I keep a little reusable cup here from Starbucks. And it's perfect guys because I'll show you the organizer but the cup fits perfectly and it doesn't like move around as you guys can see because there's like a, a little pocket here it's specifically for cups or anything I guess round I guess a glasses case could fit in here um, and then I have this pouch which this is what I was talking to you guys about I take this uh, when I'm just going into the store real quick and I don't want to take this big bag in I will just carry this um, and it has I always keep my wallet in here. So I have my wallet in here, and then sometimes I um, use this eyeglasses case to put in here and my keys and phone. That's pretty much what I use this for. Um, I absolutely love this that it came with the bag because the bag, the bag, because it's really convenient and it, it's like you get one bag and another bag. So it's like you're getting two bags for like a really, really expensive price. So I have my little pochette in the back here. And then I have my cup, like I just mentioned. So that was pretty much everything in the front, as you guys can see. So now we're gonna move into the two back pockets. So this one pocket here, I only keep my headphones so they don't get tangled. And I wrap them up like this in kind of like a circle. And I only keep them in here and that's the only thing I keep in this pocket because I don't want them getting tangled up with everything and I want them to be easy access. The next pocket I have here is a pen and a pencil. And then I have sticky notes. That's pretty much everything in here. And this pocket is just feminine products. It's feminine products and Tylenol in this little baggie because I never know when I'm gonna get like a headache or something and I might need that. But like if I was gonna travel or something, since this part like zips, I'd probably put like my wallet or anything like my passport, anything of like high value or like I don't want someone reaching and like grabbing anything. Um, I would definitely put it in this pocket because it zips. Or I would put it in the pochette because the pochette attaches to the bag, which is really, really convenient. But um, I'm gonna give you an overview of the organizer. As you can see these little black things here, that is Velcro because there comes a little pouch in here. It's kind of like, it's just like a insert that comes in here. It did come with it, but I don't use it because I don't like it. So I just keep all my other stuff here, not the little pouch thing. And the pouch thing does have a zipper. So if you click the link and you check out this organizer, you'll see everything that comes with it. But as you can see, it kindly folds like this so it doesn't make your bag look like a box. That, my friends, is everything that's in the bag. I honestly am trying to keep this bag like nice on the inside. That's another reason why I got the organizer uh, because I didn't want this bag to like become really, really dirty on the inside. I don't actually keep anything in this pocket. There's this flap 
pocket here as you guys can see I don't keep anything in it just because the organizer holds so much there is a little d-ring here and that attaches the pochette so if someone were gonna like steal something and if it's in the pochette it would be attached so it would look like this so it's like a little umbilical cord for your bag so you don't have to worry about like you know someone taking something because one really bad thing about this bag is it's like security features it's not very like secure but honestly there's so many like things like the pouch the zipper pouch back here the pouch here and like in my there's a zipper thing here and um, there's a zipper thing insert so there's many ways to keep things that you need protected protected but anyway this bag holds so much i highly recommend it if you're looking into like a luxury purchase i highly recommend the neverfull because it's just like timeless and um you actually get another bag with it and my fluff ball is either from Nordstrom or Bloomingdale's. I can't remember, but Sherry got it for me uh, because I kind of begged for it when I saw it. I was like, oh, I really like that. But it was like years and years ago. It used to be on my Juicy Couture bag, but I decided to put it on this beauty right here because I felt like she needed a little pizzazz. I really want one of those like bow things. What are they called? Twillies or something? I don't really know. But um, people put them on the little strap here and it's like a bow that like kind of hangs. It's like a ribbon almost. It's very classy looking. I really like it, but I don't know if that's in my future or not because they're kind of expensive. That is everything that's in my bag and um, it's all on my bed now. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below what type of bag you have or what type of bag you want. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.